Yo, what's up? It's B-Boy Ronnie here. Uh, I represent Full Force, Super Crew, Seven Commandos, and the Red BC with All Stars straight out of Las Vegas. So for the workshop, we have we have like a diverse B-Boys here. We have uh, Chico teaching power, uh, Pelizino. You know he does a lot of couple with us. El Nino, you know, freaking East Coast B-Boy. And I'm basically here to teach my style, and I guess uh, my style is, is just more intricate. So I'm just gonna teach a, a little bit of a, like the innovative threading style. So from there you're gonna go hop one, two, three, four, five, and six. Seven and eight. Yeah, so it can go five and six, seven and eight. Exactly. So you can bring your arm out with your legs. So boom, boom, pop, boom, boom, pop. So eight, thread, one, two, drop down three, four. Remember the level change there, yeah? You're holding on to your right knee. Now you're gonna hold on to your left knee to change that level. So two, six, five, seven, eight. Come back on your right forearm. One, thread, two, three, four, five, six. Up seven, eight, and one. Now you can take your time here because the music's really slow. So one, thread two, three, four, five, six, seven, boom. Everyone's free down eight. Like if you already know your solid foundation, if you already know your six step, then uh, you can start creating your own steps. You know what I mean? Like if you know your foundation, then you can start creating stories around it. And uh, that's basically what I do with, with a lot of the moves I make up. I, I kind of tell a story. So everything I do, I make sure it connects. I make sure it makes sense. So when you start creating your own moves, like I said, add dimension to it, create levels, and also make it make sense. You know what I mean, like, if there's a theme to something you're doing, then, then do it. And you'll see with a lot of B-boys, when they make the moves where maybe they're doing like a, a set where they're using their elbow, and they'll, they'll constantly do a set where they're on their elbow or something. So same same concept, man. I mean, just when you conceptualize your moves, always be creative. That whole project just for for any for all the b boys that were in the movie it just sort of just happened because uh, the majority of us in the movie we were competing within BC One before it even really blew up. So when I did that movie, um, of course I didn't know I was gonna win. And they had content from like 2004. They had footage from like when I first entered BC One. So. Um, I don't know, I mean, it's just like any documentary, but what makes this documentary that much more authentic is the years they put into it. I mean, I, I'm sure in 2004 they didn't know they were going to put a movie together, but all the footage that they captured within that time span, it, it ended up working out for the movie. And um, yeah, for anyone that hasn't seen the movie, check it out.
turn it loose to B-Boy documentary, it's pretty ill. And um, with the whole broad thing, I just got asked to do uh, the campaign for it. And it's cool because broad is supporting the, the B-Boy community now. So um, they're sponsoring Battle of the Year. So I've been involved with Battle of the Year, you know, judging the finals last year and just being involved with uh, the Six Step production. And uh, so now I got involved with Brian, so I'm going to start doing uh, a lot more stuff with them within the B-Boy community. So Brian's going to start supporting all the B-Boy jams and I'll be there basically doing the exact same thing, doing workshops, judging projects. Well, right now I'm, I'm juggling uh, a few things. Uh, I got my original crew, Full Force, which you know I train with my crew back home in Vegas. Uh, I got Super Crew, and we are part of uh, the Music I See Jawaki show in Vegas as well. And I, I travel with Red Bull. You know, we, we tour around the world, uh, doing workshops, uh, judging competitions, doing exhibitions, and I have this whole new broad thing going on which is really, really dope. So, Mad Mad props to Brian for supporting the B-Boy scene. And uh, we're actually gonna be back on America's Best Dance Crew uh, next week for the finale yeah. to bring back all the winners. So that's that's the next project that's literally coming up in a few days. <laughs> so uh, I'm here in New York right now teaching workshops. I got a jet out to the airport right after this. Rehearsing my crews, uh, perform with Jabberwockies, rehearse Super Crew, and, and get ready for ABDC. Shout out to all my crews. Uh, shout out to, of course, Red Bull for putting this together. Uh, shout outs to Full Force, to Super Crew, to Seven Commandos, uh, to Jabberwockies, and uh, shout out to all the B-Boys out there and B-Girls. Peace.